Hey y'all, Jen from Squizzito. I'm making a quick dinner with our new gochujang olive oil. If you haven't used this, it kind of has that soy sauce, uh, umami flavor all in the oil without any soy. It's amazing. So what I've been doing, it's super easy. We're just chopping up some carrots and green beans and sauteing those and in the gochujang oil. And then I'm gonna add some week old rice that I had in the fridge and add more gochujang oil, and then you don't even have to add any soy sauce, and I'll show you that in just a minute. Okay, so I'm just gonna add this rice, and it's, I'm telling you, it's a week old, so it's just a big chunk. I'm gonna add some more of the gochujang oil, and then I'm gonna just mash it down, and it's gonna be yummy fried rice. Okay, I added the rice, and it's big chunky because it's old, but um, you have to really refrigerate the rice to make fried rice, you know, and then I added like a, probably a tablespoon of water too, but I added two or three tablespoons of gochujang oil. So that's gonna cook down and I'll show you the results in just a minute. Okay, it's all cooked down. And so this is what the finished product looks like. It's yummy. And then I made some little dumplings that we like to go with it. So this is easy and this is something you can do. All you need is the gochujang oil and whatever vegetables you have and some old rice. So you can probably do that. Anyway, hope you like it.